Hey guys, welcome back to Ocarina of Time. And, uh, there's, there's a little something the people who play this game might know. And it's that it's time to go pull the Master Sword from its pedestal and all of that junk. But I've decided, just right this very minute on a whim, that we're gonna do a little, but ultimately inconsequential sequence break because I want to show you guys something uh, really cool. So, <clears throat> Molly, you know like the bottom of the well in Kakariko Village and how... Is it um, Kakariko? No, it's Kakariko. Says who? Says everyone. Well, that doesn't mean they're right. Are they, are they native are, speakers? Are, are they native Hylians? That's what I'm asking. Like, um, yes, yeah, some native Hylians, actually. Okay. So, this is a pretty funny way to get into the well. And since the well is done when you're a kid again, we actually have everything we need to do it now. And I just decided, let's be different. So, there's this glitch I've been doing every now and then, where you interrupt the last frame of a crouch stab by interacting with something, like picking something up or reading a sign. And as you can see, my sword is now slashing every single frame because the, like, ending of the action never occurred. Like, the what? frame <laughs> where the slash is told it's time to stop slashing never happened. So, if I pick up... <clears throat> if I pick up... A cucko like this. You're hurting it. Um, that's the point. Yeah, Hold that's on. what I'm saying. So it, if I, if I, God damn it! All right, I. Well, now you're in danger. Now I am in danger. Uh, but there's a door right there. But this one's gonna body me. Holy shit! <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. That other guy is just like whatever, man. Like leave me out of like this. Like everyone fucking knows. Just leave me and my family alone. So. But that cutscene actually plays into it. So, if I trigger that cutscene while doing something uh, specific, and you'll see what, then. God damn it, I just. If you crouch again, the game realizes that you can't be crouch stabbing. Wow, I am fucking. Amazing at this. Okay. So now... Let me grab it again. Yeah. So now I am damaging the fuck out of this Just chicken. Just by holding it. Just by holding it. It turned into a rocket ship. <laughs> so now, it is ready to do that cutscene. But, if I backflip into the well, water has no water collision during cutscenes. So now I'm just all the way down here. What the fuck? And I can just enter the bottom of the well without draining it. That was so convoluted! <laughs> so, like, just when I'm playing through this game casually, this is when I do bottom <laughs> of the well. And I decided, like, eh, why not, why not really mix things up that was with this so Let's Play? <laughs> and, um... Who the fuck figures that shit out? Well, it's just a culmination yeah. of a lot. So, now we're in the bottom of the well. And uh, I figured we can just do this now. Yeah. Because we have a lot of cutscenes <clears throat> coming up in the Temple of Time and whatnot. And I actually don't feel like watching those right now. <laughs> so we're just going to yeah. do Bottom of the Well instead. I have a lot of dread. Um, what day does this come out? Uh, Wednesday? Yeah. So this is coming out... Uh, the day after the election. And I'm wondering, like... If we'll still be America. Uh, I wonder. <laughs> this comes out. I wonder if we know. Yeah. You know, like I wonder. No, we won't because some states actually are um, have rolled because of yeah. the issues with the USPS. Um, I think Pennsylvania is accepting absentee ballots up to a week after the official election date. So to everyone watching, we still how'd don't that know. go? We, <laughs> well, we still don't know. Um, the next episode, we'll ask you how that went. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. I feel yeah. a lot of dread. Today I got trapped in a Trump parade. Um, that's like a, that's like an arrested development. Yeah. Like, and Tobias accidentally <laughs> ended up in the middle you're, of a Trump parade. You're so fucking right. So 
I was just trying to get to the interstate and there was this long line of cars with, and I was like, okay, and I turned in and then the police closed down the street and people started gathering and I was like, what the fuck is happening? And then they all started moving and everybody started putting flags up and then I was like <coughs> in a Trump parade and everybody was like waving at me and smiling so I just like looked really angry but I also like didn't want to give them the finger or anything because uh, in the last Ohio Trump parade, I don't know if you know, but two tr parade members who both supported Trump opened fire on each other. Yeah. They got in a fender bender and they got in a fight and one of them shot the other. So I'm certainly not going to be like, haha, I'm infiltrating your parade and like give people the thing or they, they would have stormed my car. Yeah. So I was actually really scared because I have like gay pride flags on my car and stuff. But then there are these people, the fucking flag that said fucking women for Trump. So I was hoping they'd be like, I was for gays Trump. for Trump. Yeah, which is fucked up because they're out there because, like, you can still be a gay white supremacist. So, um, that's probably what all those people think I was, was a gay white supremacist. It was really fucking horrible, and I was so scared, and then I found a turn off to the interstate, and I just, like, turned out. Nice. And people started honking at me, and I was like, ah! <laughs> Oh my god, it was actually really panic-inducing. <laughs> oh man, I'm re-watching Arrested Development. That's why I brought it up. But like, it totally like... And but Michael accidentally I ended know. up... I know! But it wasn't a joke, it was real! And it yeah. was so scary! Yeah. Oh man. So that's what a what wacky sequence of events you found yourself in. It wasn't wacky, it was terrible. Uh, zany? Stop. Is zany no, it the word zany. you would use? It was, so I, there was I, no there, zane to I speak of. I would use of. the word traumatizing. Well, that's stupid. Trummy. We'll make it cute. It was really trummy. It was really trummy. It was trummy. Trummy. Yeah, I like it. That's cute enough. Um, so yeah, well... Tell me more, now that you're an avowed white nationalist. No, um, God, that's, it's not even funny. It's not even <laughs> funny. Um, Why didn't you call me? I would have, like, crashed through and been like, come with me if you want to live. I was trying to focus on not running over children because a bunch of parents brought their children maskless during a pandemic to a, a parade. Well, just wait until trick-or-treating yeah. tonight, Molly. It was supposed to be Thursday. No, trick-or-treating's tonight. They, they changed it because of the weather? Yes. God damn it. Tonight. I feel like we're going to see a lot. God, I can't even... You know what? Don't even talk to me about that because I'm actually going to have a panic attack on air. Um, cool, 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 yeah, cool, cool. Yeah, it was, it was horrible, and, like, the children are guiltless. They just had a bunch of three-year-olds, like, running around this parade, and they kept running into the street to grab shit that people were throwing to them out of their cars during a pandemic. Of course. And so I was simply trying to not run over little toddlers just because their parents are evil idiots. Mr. Trump driver, have my lollipop! Yeah. Thank you, kiddo! Yeah, seriously. So I was just trying not to hit children as I navigated this horrible event. Mistake number one. No. No. Oh my god. Yes. <clears throat> that was, anyway, yeah, not the way I wanted to spend my day. It was not relaxing. And it's... You know, it's Halloween, and I didn't even say Happy Halloween. I couldn't well, even focus on that. Well, how spooky, you know? It like, was! It was the scariest Halloween I've- This is the scariest Halloween I've ever had! Okay, so, another mechanic I want to explain, that I, I don't know if I did or not, but this one's really fast. Your crouch stab actually has no set damage value every time you load in an area. It uses the damage value <clears throat> of your last attack, and the Deku Stick does more damage than the Kokiri Sword. So if you jump slash with the Deku Stick, your crouch stab will always do... Ah! Your uh, crouch stab will always do that damage. So now I can, like, fuck this guy up. Um, this, super this fast. This guy's actually really scary. Awesome style. When you pwn a lib awesome style. <laughs> um... And yeah, if you jump slash into those hands, this they don't actually grab <laughs> yeah. This is how being trapped in that parade felt like. The hand grabbed me. Yeah, the hand this grabbed thing, you. This is what everyone looked like. <laughs> yeah. That's Can what, what anti-maskers look like to me, honestly. Yeah, the way their jaws unhinge <laughs> as they lean down like, I can't hear you. Let me get closer. You, you like that? I can't hear you. Take your mask off the fuck does that yeah, mean? It doesn't, yeah, people tell me that all the time, and I'm like, I will not thank you. Yeah, I can't hear you. Take your mask off. No. Fuck you. <laughs> Come on. Be reasonable. Okay, and now we've got the Lens of Truth. Which, Dory May. Which lets you see things that don't immediately 
meet the eye. We Be won't sure meet it for a while. <laughs> uh, yeah, we will. Because there's a lot of stuff to use it on in the well, you big dum-dum. Like, hmm, why does the A button say open? Because there's a chest right there, Damn, you idiot. Damn, you got me, I'm sorry. And I like how I also just displayed why I don't need the lens of truth. Because I'm a confirmed virgin who just knows where everything is. Hold on, my um, friend just showed me a picture of her grandma. She cosplayed the first lady to the Trump rally. Nice, nice. Like, there are people nice, cosplaying nice, as Nice, them. nice, 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 nice. Cool, this cool, is cool, cool, I'm, cool. I'm out of here. I'm cool. done. Well, I'm not actually done with you. So, no, you can come with me. I'm out. I'm like, I mean, I'm out of here. Like, I'm going, like, out of this country. Out. Of, like, I'm, I'm done. All right, smuggle me in as a seal. I think that'll work. <laughs> I can't. The truth is, I'm, I am supposed to be in Ireland right now because of the pandemic. I came home for my visa to process, I've got an and idea, Molly. I'm trapped here. I'll wash up on the Irish shore, <laughs> and then you'll take care of me. <laughs> They're gonna be like. What the fuck? you come from and then it'll be like wait you guys look and sound an awful lot alike and also have the same last name and only like six people in the whole world have that last name and they're all your immediate family yeah it's like wait a minute you have the same accent and you look alike <laughs> and we can pretend to be married i guess well don't don't a lot of countries allow no my shield fuck god <laughs> damn you oh and then i fell oh good Oh, good. Fuck. Well, I guess that's it for this episode. Yeah. Here are the patrons. Don't, like, a lot of countries allow citizenship to, like, direct siblings and stuff if you have it? Um, I, I, I don't know only, if, like... Um, so, so, a lot of countries allow family-sponsored um, visas. So that would be if I had, like, cousins or aunts or uncles in, like, uh, uh, a, a European country or other countries, not just European, but in this case, since we're discussing Europe, um, they could let me come in and I could stay long enough to eventually, after a number of years, apply for the right to permanent settle. Okay. But th I wouldn't have the right to work in most cases. They would Whoa. have to fully support me. Um, and so, like, if I had, like, um, like, Slovak grandparents well we do but he's no longer living um but if our grandpa were still alive he could host us in right. in slovakia okay so yeah that's how it works well now here are the patrons for real oh i thought we were done see you guys next time <laughs> well i don't know i don't know fuck dude my shield <laughs>